Okay, the next segment we're gonna do on shooting is we're gonna get two lines. Let's get three guys over here. Let's get three guys over there. The ball is up top with me. This is a penetrate and kick series that we do all the time that works on our footwork, it works on our drive and kick, it works on our communication, and it's a lot of game shots. Okay, what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna go off the right side. I'm gonna need a manager up here giving me a ball. I'm gonna need another manager up here. We're gonna work on a V cut where you gotta work to get open. He's gotta call for the ball. Alex is gonna catch it in a strong triple threat. I need him to imagine that he's being guarded by somebody. We want him to hard attack middle right here. We're getting into the paint. And you'll see something we harp on a lot of times in a drill, you got to really be on your guys. Let me see the ball, Alex. A lot of times on penetrating kick drills, you'll watch your players and they'll start doing this. Like that. That's not penetrating kick. You have to, now whether you, you might be able to have a coach here or somebody stand here. If not, really be on your guys. When they drive, they got to get to the paint. We say drive to score. I want them thinking about scoring. You drive the score, and now all of a sudden the defense collapses, and now I have my bailouts on kicks. But we want them to drive to score. So Alex is going to drive. Now it's Ryan's responsibility. He's going to start on the wing. He cannot stand in that spot. A defense, any, or any defense that's worth anything at all, they're going to have good help side. If he stays in that position as Alex drives, that's a hard pass. That puts a lot of pressure on Alex to make a really good pass against pressure. Ryan has two things he can do. He can slide behind the ball and give him an outlet right there. Or if he sees the defense slide up, he can chase to the corner. And again, just like we did, we say we want to be locked and loaded. He's got to get his feet ready. And again, he's catching it. And we're going to go with a catch and shoot. Just like we said in the three-man two-ball shooting, after Alex makes this pass, it's not like football where now we can go have a huddle and talk. You got to keep playing. So after he passes, Alex now has to get to an open area, and I as a coach will have a ball up top. So after he drives and kicks, give it to Alex. Walk through it, drive middle, kick. Now Alex is playing off me. So now I'll drive, he can go there, he can chase out opposite, but he's got to get to an open area, and now he's playing off me, so both guys get a shot. Okay, so we're gonna go middle drives. Right now, it, we, could, we do it different ways. You can do it where the whole team's working together. Okay, the whole team's working together to get a number. You can do it where if you have an even number, the groups of two are playing against each other. You know, we're, we're, we're playing to 10 makes as a group, or like right now, just for the sake of the drill, we're just gonna go one time through where everybody goes through where it gets back to Alex at the start. V cut, catch and face, middle drive, good, get to the open area, good, step into it, shot. Next group, V cut, catch and face, good, drive to score, good, do different things. Okay, stop. One of the things, and this is just a teaching point, not bad by Rashid, but when he came back out here, this is how your feet were, Rashid. If you're going to shoot from there, I want to get three, four. If you're going to shoot from there, and that's where we want our guys to understand where the lines are on the floor. If you're going to shoot a shot from here, I might as well get three, four. So that's where we got to get behind the three-point line, so when we step in, we're not stepping on the line.